<laughs> Don't look at me. Backstage at the Aganis Arena with 21 Pilots, Josh Tyler. Guys, how are you doing? I'm well. So is Tyler. <laughs> Tyler won't be you doing, he'll just be handling the microphone tonight. I'm just a mic stand. Okay, very good. Oh, very good. Uh, he's a mic stand. <laughs> So I want to start off on a little bit of a serious note. I know that you guys recently did a tribute to uh, Christina Grimmie, who covered your song Doubt. And in the last show that you guys did down in New Jersey, uh, you threw that out there and you kind of gave her a nice tribute. Was that something that you had planned on doing before or is that something you're going to continue to do on the tour? Um, it, it probably uh, won't be something we continue to, to remind everyone of, mm -hmm. um, even though it's not you don't want to forget uh, someone like her. I actually... I actually watched her her covers and her YouTube videos before mm -hmm. things even started taking off for us. Like, I remember watching her sing and just uh, really being blown away by her talent. And her, I really respected that she played the piano yeah. too while she sang, and mm -hmm. it's just really it's a really cool um, just a vibe that you got from her. And uh, so, in, in a in a way, I felt like I knew who she was, and mm -hmm. uh, she'd you know been a part of you know a small part of my life and to to hear that news it was it was a really weird feeling um for us because and, and not that I, we think that we're in any particular danger but we do meet and greets every day yeah every every day we do that and i was gonna and ask you if, you if you guys have changed any of the any of your habits as a result of what no happened. there's really nothing you can change it, mm -hmm. it just kind of uh you realize that we're, you're in a world where anyone can do anything at any moment mm -hmm. and uh when you're in a, a live concert setting uh on stage uh it just i don't know it, it uh it can get to you if you think about it too much mm -hmm. and i'm just such a firm believer in live music and how it, you can't you can't you can't replicate the feeling that you get when you go to a live show anywhere else, no matter how much technology will advance. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like live music will always be there. And even, even when there's attacks on it, um, I just, uh, I hope that, uh, it's, it still stays around. Um, mm -hmm. but all that to say, like yeah. when you hear news like that, you know, Josh and I, we sat down, we talked about like, this is a weird feeling. You know, yeah. it can, it can at any moment, man. Yeah. And so, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a heavy topic. Sorry, but it was a <sighs> solid tribute. You guys did a solid tribute. Yeah, no, she so, so she covered doubt. Um, and I, I've seen that video. Mm -hmm. Like and, I watched uh, it. It was so powerful. Yeah. She and was so, so good at it. So it just kind of made sense. Mm -hmm. You know, it was a song that she covered of ours and, uh, some of the lyrical content even mm -hmm. kind of like leaned towards that, even though it wasn't originally written for that purpose, but mm -hmm. that's, what's great about music. It's, it's alive. It can move. Yeah. It can, it can apply to the situation you're in. Mm -hmm. And, uh, that's why, you know, we never get sick of our own songs because those songs are, are always changing their meaning and what mm -hmm. they, they mean to us. And, and now that song doubt, which already has a very powerful meaning to me, um, it kind of added a whole other layer of meaning, which, mm -hmm. um, I guess I'm, I'm grateful that music is able to do that. So moving, transitioning over to another one of your songs, Stressed Out, absolutely smash hit. It's been around, and it just blew up this January. Just, you know, it's been on fire. And the video is one of those iconic videos that people are going to look back 10 years, 15, 20 years from now, <laughs> and they're going to be like, dude, do you remember that? That video from Stressed Out, the kids on the big wheels? <laughs> do you guys get to keep those big wheels? Yeah, yeah. Um my my dad bugs me because he wants them out of the, his garage because we uh we shot we shot the the video at yeah. uh half and half of our, mm -hmm. our parents houses and uh, they just ended up there and uh so he's kind of like i got stuff to like put in here and they're still there but i ride them whenever i'm there so speaking also of the video the the handshake at the door do you guys do that every day when you meet each other every time you see each other probably like three or four times a day i think okay yeah could you do it for me right now? Could you do the handshake? Do you remember? I that? forget it. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's Has it evolved into a, a bigger handshake or anything? No, no, like no. That? It hasn't. It's stayed true. It's, okay. Uh, it's, so it's, that's it. That's that's, it. That's, that's what it is. We worked r pretty hard on that. <laughs> uh, it we st we didn't sleep one night. Okay. Just kind of stayed up and worked on the handshake. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now you guys were talking about your parents' houses where you, you shot the video. Now I've been reading a lot of uh, interviews that you guys have done, and it seems like you guys are pretty close with your moms. And you have some interesting stories with your mom. Like, uh, for instance, uh, was it Tyler? Did you, uh, is your mom 
uh, over the fact that you inadvertently broke her arm with the uh, the hoverboard? Uh, yeah, but I feel like there's a, a little bit of like bitterness and you know <laughs> everything she says to me because of that. Why uh, did you get your mom on a hoverboard to begin with? Someone gave me that as a present, mm-hmm. and um, I don't know what what else do you do with that thing other than like ask. I don't give to it to my it. mom. I know I know that much. Yeah, I don't know. It happened so fast. I was right there. I was like, because it's a really weird thing to get the hang of, and uh, it just, it happened, it all happened so fast, man, mm-hmm. um, <laughs> and uh, I, you know, I sat in the, the ER waiting room with her, like, all day, <laughs> you know, and I felt so horrible, and... That's the worst, that's the worst, but like, when you, you, know? you inadvertently hurt somebody you love, and you're like, oh my god, this is totally my fault. I mean, it was hilarious when it happened, it just, <laughs> the result sucked. Now, uh, I also saw something where uh, your moms have gone to the same uh, great clips in your town. Have have you guys been able to afford to get them out of great clips yet? Yeah. So there was a they actually I think they're so proud of us that they they <laughs> talk about us to even their people that are cutting their hair. Mm-hmm. So they both were talking to this lady and she kind of uh, was like, well, the other there was somebody else in the band's mom that I cut their hair and. So they kind of <laughs> then realized that that's that's the entire band. Yeah, there's only two of you. Same lady. <laughs> and we were like, we, we need to get them out of Great Clips. Nothing against Great no, Clips. No, absolutely. Great Clips is fantastic. But, but would you have a little bit of money? A little, a little it's bit not fantastic. It's, it's, it's just not great. fantastic. It's great. That's, yeah, it's, it's great. It's, it's great is what it is. So we wanted <laughs> that's That's about the ceiling right yeah, there. It's yeah. Great Clips. <laughs> um, so we decided for one hometown show that we mm-hmm. would get them uh, gift cards, gift certificate things. We like wrapped them up. To a nicer, a fantastic clips, <laughs> and uh, and we actually passed them out during the show and had like the crowd. They were actually on opposite sides of the balcony, so the crowd we wouldn't play the next song until they passed them all the way up to our mom. I love that. And now every like couple months, my mom will text and be like, "I don't want to have to go back to great clips." And so <laughs> she she's like, "Could you PayPal me some money?" Yeah, and so I have to send her. Again, you that's know. fantastic. <laughs> Josh, Tyler, 21 Pilots tonight at the Agana Arena. Two nights sold out. Thank you guys so much for coming uh, out and doing the interview. We appreciate it. Yeah, thanks, man. Awesome.